Welcome to Jesus Christ Forever, a sanctuary where we delve into the timeless wisdom of Scripture. Today, let's reflect on Isaiah 41 verse 10 from the King James Version, which says, Fear thou not, for I am with thee, be not dismayed, for I am thy God. I will strengthen thee, yeah, I will help thee, yeah, I will uphold thee with the right hand of my righteousness. Fear thou not this is a command often reiterated throughout the Bible urging believers to have faith and trust in God's sovereignty, rather than being consumed by fear or anxiety. For I am with thee, here, God reassures his people of his constant presence, echoing promises found throughout scripture where God promises never to leave nor forsake his own. Be not dismayed, the word dismayed implies being discouraged or distressed. God encourages his people not to lose heart or be overwhelmed by challenges, but to find strength in him. For I am thy God, God identifies himself as the personal God of his people, establishing a covenantal relationship. This signifies his commitment to care for, protect, and provide for his chosen ones. I will strengthen thee, God promises to infuse his people with divine strength. This strength isn't merely physical but encompasses spiritual fortitude to endure trials and overcome obstacles. Yeah, I will help thee, alongside strength, God pledges his assistance. This assistance extends beyond human capabilities, illustrating God's willingness to intervene in the affairs of his people. Yeah, I will uphold thee with the right hand of my righteousness. The right hand symbolizes strength, favor, and authority in biblical imagery. God assures his people that he will support and sustain them with his righteous hand, indicating his unwavering commitment to uphold his righteous standards and protect his faithful ones. Before we conclude, let's come together in prayer. Heavenly Father, we thank you for your promise of strength and assistance. May this verse serve as a beacon of hope for all who hear it, anchoring their hearts in your boundless love and grace. Thank you for joining us today. If this message has touched your heart, we encourage you to like, share, and subscribe to Jesus Christ forever, spreading the comforting truth of God's word to all who need it. Until we meet again, May you find peace in his promises. Amen.